grand finale of my Harry Potter and the Pan of Fire project pan. This is a Pantastic Ladies collab. I will link all of their information as always for you down below along with some other collaborators in this project. I've really, really enjoyed this project. It was based on the game of Quidditch and your favourite uh, house um, in the Harry Potter books, films, games, whatever. Um, and yeah, I have absolutely loved this project pan. And I think it was because it, A, it was a small project. Um, there was uh, four, um, three items for the Quidditch game and then two items for your favourite house. So we had a golden snitch item, bludger item, quaffle item, and then two for your favourite house colours. Um, and I have had massive success with this project pan. I've already hit goal on my golden snitch item, which was my bronze and glow bronzer uh, in the I Heart Makeup uh, uh, bronze and glow palette. So I hit pan on the bronzer. In fact, I didn't just hit pan, I made massive pan on that. So massively happy with that. For the bludger, um, I was using a highlighter in my Ultra Contour Palette by Makeup Revolution and again I completely used that all up and in fact I've now finished the Ultra Contour Palette altogether. It is now an empty. For the Quaffle I had my Benefit Benny Balm lipstick, uh, well a balm and um, there wasn't a lot of it, it was only a mini but I have used all of that up. And for my favourite house, which I chose Ravenclaw because I kind of had to because my daughter is called Rowena. So the Harry Potter fans will notice the link. Um, so I had to choose Ravenclaw as my favourite house. And for the brown uh, or bronze colour and blue colour, I chose a Physician's Formula Eyeliner in brown and a Clarins Gentle Eye Makeup Remover. The Clarins Gentle Eye Makeup Remover was only a sample again, but I have used that all up in previous updates. I will link my playlist for you down below, so if you are wondering what the hell I'm talking about and rushing through, uh, you can go back and watch the playlist and see it all in full glory. So. I was actually, for this final month, only left with one product and that was my Physician's Formula Eyeliner in the shade Brown. This was my bronze item for Ravenclaw and because I was doing so well and I only had one item to work with, I decided to choose a second house to work with. Um, so I am actually, according to Pottermore on the website, I'm actually a Hufflepuff. And the colours for that were uh, yellow and black. So I chose two more items to go with that. So let me run through what I have left. So the Physician's Formula. It's all gone. Look, look, none left. It won't even click anymore. It has gone, it is down to the thing. I can't get any more out. I finished it. I can't believe it. I have finished an eyeliner this year. Do you know how much of a struggle that is for me? Um, I don't go through eyeliners very quickly at all. Um, so I am so pleased I have finished an eyeliner. Whoop, whoop. So that is all of my original products chosen for this project pan, completely finished out. This has got to be one of the most successful project pans I've ever done because I've never had a hundred percent like goals hit in a project pan before. And then on to the extra items that I put in. That was my phone, sorry. Um, the extra items I put in because I was doing so well. Um, I put in these argan oil eye patches. Um, there was, it, the box originally contains four treatments. Um, they're just like the eye patches that you put under your eyes and they're gold. Um, but when I put it in the project pan, I only had three packets left because I'd already used one up previously. 
and they're gone. No more. <laughs> um, look, these eye patches. It gets me sat down and relaxing. I just put on some music. I lay back. I relax. It gets me relaxing for about 20 minutes. Does it do anything for my eyes? I don't really think so. I don't think it actually does anything, or these cheap ones don't actually do anything. All it actually does is get me to sit down for 20 minutes and relax. Simple. I mean, if that's not going to make your skin feel a little better anyway, because you're not as stressed, then it's doing its job. I don't think it actually does anything. It's more the 20 minutes you're sitting down and relaxing, listening to music that's actually doing more for your skin than this. So that is that finished. And then the last item for black uh, was my brow pencil. Uh, this came in a Makeup Revolution brow palette. And as you can see, there is a little bit left. Okay, there is a little bit left, but I'm calling this done. And the reason why I'm calling this done is because when I put this into my pencil sharpener, A, this pencil is not the normal size for a pencil. So like with an eyeliner, you it's generally thicker. Um, this doesn't fit into my pencil sharpener very well, so it kind of, it doesn't sharpen properly. But also as well is by the time I've got like holding it, trying to sharpen it, I'm my fingers are catching on the side of the pencil sharpener. So it's getting harder and harder to sharpen. So even though there is a little bit of product left in there and I will continue to use this until I literally cannot use it anymore. And it's getting like that now. It is getting down to the nubbin. Um, but I'm calling this done. I'm calling this an empty because I simply cannot sharpen it anymore. So that is that. So I have a hundred percent completely finished all my products for this project pan. Whoop, whoop. So I, as you can imagine, I'm, I'm, I'm elated. I'm absolutely elated. So yeah, this was a very successful project pan for you, for me, not for you. For you maybe watching it but for me um very successful project pan for me i am so happy that i joined in with this one i have moved out one two well mm, one two three four five six items out of my project pan the seventh item which is the bronzer there is still product left in there but put it in another project pan and it will be gone like that so so happy so happy so if you enjoyed this video please like comment and subscribe uh hit the bell button for notification of my next video going up and i will see you in the next video.